say it and you give it more fun. People that have power do not give up power. So women cannot wait for things to happen or have power given to them. It just won't happen. I'm Olivia Chow, Member of Parliament for Trinity Spadina, also a New Democrat. Women are very practical. They want to get things done. My degree is in fine arts, but uh, I first got involved in um, trying to make sure that some of the Vietnamese boat people that are out in sea uh, would be allowed to come in as refugees. Um, and that was my first political campaign. And then I realized that Canada uh, and being elected can make a big difference. Not only can you determine how a young person can grow up being educated in Canada, you could also change laws that can, in fact, allow some of these kids to either come to Canada or make sure that Canada is doing our part to deal with child poverty or world hunger. That's what motivated me to enter politics, and it still motivates me today to continue to be involved in politics. I was involved in electing a member of parliament, a new Democrat, uh, his name is Dan Heap. And then I saw uh, that, oh, that's what a member of parliament can do. That's what an elected representative can do. It can change laws. Unless you change the law, I can spend my entire life helping individual to overcome their barriers, make their life better. But it could tick me many lifetime, and it's still the law remain the same, it would still be unfair. So I thought, okay, let's change the law. And that's when I said, well, uh, maybe I could work for someone that could change the law. And then I figured, oh, I can change the law. <laughs> Unless young women participate, Canada will never have a universal high quality and affordable childcare, early learning programs. Uh, we will never be able to end child poverty and make sure our kids grow up healthy. So if you are thinking that you want to make a difference in lives of uh, children or, or for seniors, uh, for productivity of this country, you have to be involved in politics. You have to be involved uh, in making change. We need to make sure that we have an electoral system that is fair, that is a proportional representation, that every votes count. In countries that have electoral reform, you see there are far more women elected in government. We are stuck in the old ways. That's why we need to change. Today can be another landmark for Canadians. There has to be eco voices in Parliament in all legislation. You have to change so that a government would reflect the wishes of the majority of Canadians, including women. If not, there's no equality. If there's no equality, then Canadians uh, will not have the high quality of life as we should have. Don't let them tell you it can't be done. Of course it can. Mm -hmm.